On behalf of the CIBC First Caribbean family, I would like to thank all of you for coming out today. I know every year we are going bigger and bigger. The awareness, we are happy in terms of the level of awareness that is being created among um, St. Kitts Davis. Um, we thank you for your continued support. And I know that some of us have been touched personally by somebody who has been affected by cancer. And so we understand that that is the reason why we come together also to support this. This is our fourth year, and as I mentioned earlier, our work is becoming bigger and bigger, which means that the awareness is really getting stronger and stronger. We hope that in, in the near future, we would see a, a unit at our, our, our local hospital so that it can also help us to cut down on the cost for persons going overseas for care and attention persons who are affected by cancer. Um, we are supposed to be starting with a word of prayer. I don't know if Reverend Joseph is here from Arabian Church. Okay. So we have a word of prayer to guide us on our way to Frigate Bay. After the prayer, Mr. Hanley would have a word with you. We'll have a little warm-up for those of us who only walk once per year. <laughs> Good afternoon. Let us pray. Loving God, we thank you, Lord God, for the initiative that was set forth for us to be aware of cancer, dear God. We thank you, dear God, as we stand in support of those persons who are affected and infected, who would have lost loved ones and are suffering, you know, with cancer. We thank you, dear God, that we could gather this afternoon. We ask as we depart to leave, dear God, you strengthen our bodies. As I said, some of us only walk once a year, and not as often as we should. But we ask there now that you strengthen us for the task ahead. Be with us. Give us strength for the journey. We give you thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Okay, just a, a, a little plug for next weekend. On Saturday, this coming Saturday, there's going to be an extension of this event at the square. It's called the Pink Dress Run. Okay? Well, it's not going to be just a run. It's going to be a walk also. So, those of you who can walk or run, doesn't matter. Okay, come on out. Uh, but wear something pink. But we especially want you to wear dresses, all right? Or some uh, costume form of dress, but in pink, all right? It is also in support of this event. So come on out in all your pink and your pink dresses. And when I say pink dresses, I mean the men too, eh? All right? Uh, it starts at 3 o'clock, Palma, uh, not Palma, Independence Square. Okay? So, three. What time is it uh, come on out at 3.30, 3.30 on Saturday, um, Independence Square, alright, 3.30 Independence Square, and um, it's a, a pink dress run, so make sure you come on out in your pink and Again, support um, the call. thanks to also to our sponsors and all the groups, the cancer support groups who are represented here today, thanks again, I'll leave it to the fit and the young to do the warm up part. <laughs> Okay, good afternoon. If you just get a good area, um, we're going to start our warm up session. And we will find up the